Hi, I'm Walter Jackson, the Superintendent of Schools for Laporte ISD. The health and safety of our students and staff are our top priorities. We continue to monitor and adjust our plans in response to evolving COVID-19 conditions, relying on local health and state authorities for guidance. I want to visit with you about some of the questions that have been posed. I ask for your grace and patience as we navigate through the start of this school year. Self-screening. Students and staff are required to self-screen each day prior to accessing a campus or district facility. The self-screener guidelines for students and staff are available on our website. What about face masks? Masks are strongly encouraged, but not mandated or required. How will attendance be counted? Student attendance will be earned through in-person instruction. Virtual instruction is not offered at this time. What's happening with bus transportation this year? Face masks are strongly encouraged on our school buses as social distancing is not possible. Parents are encouraged to drive their children to and from school when possible. What is the cafeteria procedure for this year? Designated tables that allow for social distancing will be available at every campus. Refillable water bottle stations are accessible at each campus and visitors for breakfast and lunch will not be allowed due to safety concerns. I'd now like to introduce Angie Viator. She is the Executive Director of Human Resources here in Laporte. She assists our campus and staff members with COVID-19 protocols. Thank you. Thank you so much, Dr. Jackson. We have been asked how are you mitigating the spread of germs in the classroom? Cleaning supplies and hand sanitizer will be available in every classroom. The use of shared supplies will be limited. Hand sanitizing stations will be available in common areas. What is the visitor policy this year? Campuses are encouraged to utilize virtual meetings to engage families. All visitors are encouraged to wear a mask while on campus. To protect the health and safety of students, parents are not permitted to eat breakfast or lunch with their student. At what point will students and staff be excluded from school and school activities? Local and state guidelines have been updated to include a mandatory 10-day minimum exclusion from school and school activities for students and staff who test positive for COVID-19. Symptomatic individuals will be required to self-isolate and may be allowed to return after meeting readmission criteria, such as an alternative diagnosis or a negative COVID-19 test. What if parents want additional information about district health and safety guidelines? It would be best to refer to the 2021-2022 student and employee process maps for specific guidance on the district website. The district will continue to offer COVID-19 rapid testing for students and staff this year. We will continue to monitor COVID-19 guidance and will keep you updated as information becomes available. We appreciate your partnership as we look forward to a safe and successful school year. Thank you so much. Mm -hmm.